Zylo never intended to revolutionize agriculture. He was just a lowly Zylanian in turn, tasked with tinkering with the humble Flusa. On Zyler, Flusas were the backbone of their sustenance, plump, bioluminescent tubers that provided both nutrition and light. Unfortunately, Flusas were notoriously finicky, requiring specific humidity levels and a near-constant humming frequency, a constant headache for farmers. Zylo, with his oversized goggles and perpetually grass-stained lab coat, tinkered with a reckless abandon that would make any senior zylologist shudder. This time, he stumbled upon a gene sequence that shouldn't have existed, a mutation he'd dubbed Flusax. Nervous, but fueled by a strange optimism, Zylo planted a single seed in a discarded nutrient chamber. Days turned into weeks, and the chamber remained stubbornly barren. Just as Zylo was about to admit defeat, a sprout emerged, impossibly vibrant green with an almost iridescent sheen. This Flusa X grew at an alarming rate, dwarfing its regular counterparts within days. Curiosity turned to fear as the plant towered over Zylo's lab, its bioluminescence pulsing with an otherworldly intensity. The news, as expected, reached the esteemed Zylanian Agricultural Council. Zylo, fearing exile for genetic malpractice, braced himself for the worst. But upon inspection, the council's faces contorted not in anger, but in awe. Flusa X produced ten times the yield of a regular Flusa, thrived in any environment, and emitted a hum that soothed rather than irritated. Zylo, the clumsy in turn, had accidentally created a super Flusa. News of Zylo's creation spread like wildfire across Zyler. Famines became a distant memory, cities glowed brighter than ever, and farmers finally received a well-deserved break. Zylo, once a lab outcast, became a celebrated hero. He received a lifetime supply of his favorite fizzy algae drink and a lab ten times the size of the previous one, which Flusa X promptly filled to capacity within a week. But Zylo couldn't help but look at his creation with a hint of trepidation. Flusa X grew with such abandon that it threatened to engulf the entire planet in its verdant glow. Zylo, the accidental revolutionary, now faced a new challenge, how to control the very thing that had saved his people. The quest for a solution, he realized with a sigh, was about to begin.